Gosh, we have just uh, gifted him with something special. He's very excited about it. Tell us, what do you got? Uh, well, we're on the air over time, so I appreciate you uh, squeezing me in here. Yeah, That's well, oh, now we expand the program for you, John. Yeah, I love it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and you've got this little complimentary gift there at the door. Yep. I don't exactly know what you call this, but it's like a little uh, dog tag of sort. Well, all of our right? guests get a prize package, uh, makeup, and yeah. locally Kip made Yeah, Kip took a food couple, products. actually. So. Yeah, yeah. It says WSKI right on there with the website, so yeah. you know where to go to get the information. I, I forget the slogan. Yeah. No, and then no. in the back, it's yeah. got a little stash here for your doggy do bags. Uh, you how will. many do you think are in there? I think there's probably 20 in there. Could be a trivia question. And I just... Yeah. Noticed for the first time. <laughs> but these are great to have. You know, it's awesome to uh, clean up after your, your uh, when family you're trail master when you're on the trails. Yeah. Because it's pretty not nice to not Everyone do that. Everyone was wondering how And then once you in. use the bag, you're supposed to take it back with you. You don't just, you know, leave it there on the ground for... I put it in my for pocket. For Deb to pick up. Yeah, I put it in my pocket. That's great. Yeah. I appreciate that. Yeah. And uh, so lots of trails, and you are, uh, CR Nemba has got, uh, what, what's this right here? That's my coffee. Oh, okay. Just wondering what was that. Carabazza coffee? Yeah, yeah. it is. Yeah. But uh, does Nemba have a coffee mug too? You know what? Nemba does have a uh, coffee mug. Yeah. Yep. And they have some uh, like reusable pint glasses and all of that sort of stuff. You can go on the Nemba.org website and get to the you know, retail department and all that. Yeah. And they're doing seasonal gear as well. So like right now they have hoodies and then a nice sweater that might be wool, I, I bet. Um, there's hats, there's all sorts of things, socks right. and whatever. Why should you be a member of NIMBA? Why should you be a member of NIMBA? Well, I mean, every guest that you've had on here <clears throat> this morning has been talking about mountain biking and yeah, mountain biking is great. It's, it's exploding in Carabasset and it really is the mountain bike club and the, the volunteers that are involved with that organization that are um, pushing the agenda and, yeah. and asking that we build more trail and take care of more trail and have events and have races um, and do those sorts of things. It really is the advocacy group that's that's promoting the the sport right. in our region and and around New England and around the country and around the world really. So and it's catching it's on. Yeah, and it's catching on. You know, mountain biking is as a sport is growing is huge. Um, and just supporting your local chapter is is really important and. You can, you know, there's people from all around the state that are here this weekend, right? There's chapters all around the state that you can, sure. that you can join, and we're all sort of the same kind of mothership um, throughout New England. And the, as Nemba has brought a lot of new faces here, would you agree with that? Yeah, I would. You know, being being a chapter of the of the larger, you know, regional organization in New England, when we have events, it's easy for us to market to people that live in Connecticut or live in Rhode Island that maybe have never been up here at all or have never been up here to ride you know mm. maybe they're here to ski or something like that um, but it's great to you know bring them back to the community at a time of year when it might be different than winter time right um, for them to you know enjoy the trails and go to a restaurant and see you downtown handing these out or, <laughs> or whatever you know shaking hands yeah yeah shaking hands yeah. kissing babies pick it up deal. returnables yeah whatever yeah. it takes exactly. uh, and uh so a uh, number is a it, how many members do you have in number right now our, the, the, our chapter here um our chapter is right around 200 we've yeah. been around 200 for a little bit i think that we're you know that's probably a sustainable number for us there are hmm. other chapters with more there are other chapters with less uh i think that we could grow that membership for sure um right at the moment what we're trying to do is grow our leadership and growing the the membership that really wants to be more involved. And mm -hmm. we have our tent set up in the base area, uh, which I don't know when exactly it will be set up, but I think around nine or 10. So let's say 10. Yeah, let's say 10, cause it's, you know, past nine now. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, come to the tent. If you, if you ride here, if you have a place here, if you're interested in the trails or interested in the, in the promotion of the, of the sport and the good of that, come to the tent and, and uh, you know, just chat with us. If you want to get more involved, um, you know, just tell the people there that you want to get more involved and we'll, we'll figure out a way to get in touch. You with won't you. have to say it twice. Yeah, I just did. But <laughs> you might, you might, you might. And what that, are your skills? That's what we're going to say. What are your skills? Uh, bring your, bring your hatchet with you. Uh, that is the website right there. That is the website. Yeah. And you can go there. That's where you get your membership. Or can you sign up over there? You can sign up over there. You can go to the website and get a membership. Uh, yeah. you know, either way. Yeah. Go over and see them. Click and pay. Yeah, click and pay and stop by the table. Yeah, thanks. Sorry I missed you this week. We'd love to have you guys out to uh, to do some shooting in the field. Absolutely. This week just didn't, it wasn't going to happen. Uh, but I know there's always plenty to shoot, so we'll be we'll be rescheduled. There's now. plenty to shoot, and now that you're going up to the range to practice, you know, maybe... Uh... <laughs>
You'll be. I you. can't wait. <laughs> yeah, I hope down they, range, down yeah, range. I, 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 they'll be able to reuse all those clay pigeons, which will be great. Really? Yeah. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Thanks, Josh. Wait, wait, wait. Josh, 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 what are you, what are you excited about? This, what, what are you excited? Well, about? what am I excited my, about? My uh, what am I excited about? Um, I'm excited about the whole thing. I mean, really, we're we're at this place where we have large projects in front of us, where we have good relationships with the the people that we work with. Talk and, about Stony Brook. Uh, Stony Brook, yeah, we're we're building trail network just north of here, um, just past the AT crossing, um, on the other side of the Crocker Mountain. Crocker Mountain from here, <laughs> if you will. Uh, the state owns a big parcel of land up there, and they've agreed. We've been working with them for 10 yeah. or 15 years, and and they've agreed to let us build. So, you know, Deb and I worked last fall really hard to raise a bunch of money and. Um, you know, we went through all the permitting steps and all of that, and we've been up there for a few years building, so we have some trail there for people to ride, and there's some information there as well on the CR Number website about that. You kind of have to go through the links, but um, if you find the Stony Brook tab there, it will give you some information about where the trails are, how to access them. We, we have plans to develop a trailhead and parking area up there, mm -hmm. um, which we're going to try to do next spring. We're just asking people right at the moment to park appropriately. There's information on the website as to where to park. Um, don't park on the side of Route 27. Don't park on Plum Creek Road. Don't park the AT parking. Don't park here. Don't park there. Uh, but there are definitely a couple spots that are close there. As well, if you're looking for a big ride, you can always park right here uh, in the area and, and ride up there. There you go. Great information. There it is. Regent Nemba, and go check out their table. I'm excited the about the big line. moose that's been hanging around. Oh, Everybody keep that, their eyes huh? out. There's a large healthy moose one. in our neighborhood. Yeah, healthy one. Yeah. Yeah. It's good. That's good. You yeah. see a lot of moose while you're out there trail building. You know, we see a lot of everything out a there. A lot of everything. Building. Turkeys. That's what we've been seeing of late. Yeah. Turkeys. Yeah. They're everywhere. They're aggressive. It's like a woods pigeon. Yeah. You know <laughs> a woods pigeon. <laughs> If there's one, there's a hundred. Remember the one that went up and down the road a, a couple of years ago? Did it, it cross hanging, the road? It, no, it no. was hanging out on the access road, and then finally it flew into someone's uh, car window, broke its neck, and it was part of a Thanksgiving meal. It had a happy ending. For real? For real. I've never heard that story yep, They before. got it, yep. Uh, 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 the game warden blessed it. and, and uh, Blessed it? Yep. <laughs> like a... Uh, what do they call that? Your final rights? Yeah, Is it yeah, sort of that like sort of thing? That. Yeah. You're blessed you, to go to the table. You will be <laughs> for the oven. at Thanksgiving. Yeah. <laughs> Josh hey, Pass all the parking lots have have numbers or have letters, right? A, B, C, D, E, yeah, F. Yeah. What is parking lot F? What does that mean? What does that stand for? Do you know? Oh, I got something else to tell you, too. Oh, go ahead. Uh, Allison Lewis Food Truck, the wheelhouse, is going to be at Freeman Ridge Bike Park on Monday morning oh. for brunch. And they make killer food. So if you're looking for something to do, uh, and you want to do a little riding and get some really good food yeah. at Freeman Ridge Bike Park. You, you guys know where that is, It's Andy. located at Freeman Ridge. It's located at Freeman Ridge. <laughs> Google it. You'll find it. Nice hill, too. Yep. Lot yeah. F. It's yeah. got a tricky name to it, but maybe watch and win for a couple of these Lot next time. Lot F. Well, think we, about it. I'm going to think about it. Josh Towson, thank you so much. Join him over there at the table in the basement.